Hello everyone, welcome back to Govan Chef's Kitchen. So, if you are new to my channel, please make sure you like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And also, don't forget to hit the bell icon so that you don't miss up on any of my coming up vlogs. So, friends, today we are going to prepare a very simple and easy dish. Today, we are going to prepare a very simple and easy dish. Today, we are going to prepare a very simple and easy dish. Today, we are going to prepare a very simple and easy dish. Today, we are going to prepare a very simple and easy dish. Today, we are going to prepare a very simple and easy dish. Today, we are going to prepare a very simple and easy dish. Today, we are going to prepare a very simple and easy dish. Today, we are going to prepare a very simple and easy dish. Today, we are going to prepare a very simple and easy dish. Today, we are going to prepare a very simple and easy dish. Today, we are going to prepare a very simple and easy dish. Today, we are going to prepare a very simple and easy dish. Today, we are going to prepare a very simple and easy dish. Today, we are going to prepare a very simple and easy dish. Today, we are going to prepare a very simple and easy dish. Today, we are going to prepare a very simple and easy dish. Today, we are going to prepare a very Ingredients I have used one big chopped onion, one medium-sized chopped tomato, one teaspoon of ginger garlic paste, one chopped chili, salt to taste, oil, Goan sausages about twenty-five to thirty beets, red kidney beans which has been soaked overnight. You can also use the thin kidney beans or you can prepare it in the cooker it's completely your choice so here i have boiled my red kidney beans with some salt and some boiling water and this is pretty much it they are nicely cooked so this is how they look once they are nicely cooked please skin the goan sausages or the pork sausages and it's time to begin with the preparation so i have added oil in a pan in that i'm going to add my big chopped onion and the ginger garlic paste and mix it well once it is nicely mixed well and cooked i'm to add in our chilies add in the chopped tomato and mix it well time to add in our salt and the kidney beans mix it well so all the ingredients blend well together and then add in our sausages now the sausages itself is so flavorful that you don't need to add any extra flavor for that it just changes the entire flavor of the dish add a little bit of water mix it well and then cover it and let it cook for about 5 to 7 minutes once it is nicely prepared this is how it is going to look if you like it a little bit more saucy you can add a little bit of water in that we prefer it dry so we have left it this way so this is it friends it's a simple easy and quick recipe if you have liked my today's vlog please make sure you like share and subscribe to my channel and also don't forget to hit the bell icon so that you don't miss up on any of my coming up vlogs we will see you very very soon till then take care bye bye so glam tumka dyo bare kare thank you